On Gold Cup Day, the glories of Royal Ascot are revealed by German British News in this artistic presentation. Then the fashionable throng steps daintily across the green turf to complete a picture worthy of the brush of a great painter. Once more, royalty honored the meeting by coming over from Windsor, the king and queen taking a walk through the royal enclosure. sunshine greeted the very large assembly as they looked forward to the big event of the afternoon. All ready for the Ascot Gold Cup, the most valuable event ever contested in this country and incidentally Ascot's oldest race being first run in 1807. They're off, a field of only six on a roughly triangular course of two and a half miles. The race was full of incident as Scarlet Emperor and Trimbush, the two English bred horses, led the field past the stand. Round the last bend and then things began to happen as the French horse, Souvenir, leapt ahead. Sweeping along to the rails, Souvenir established a wide lead which he never lost. <laughs> Souvenir flew past the winning post four lengths ahead of Chanteur with field day coming up third. So ends another glorious day at Ascot and we take one more glimpse at the striking scene in front of us before saying farewell to this garden party in the sunshine.